pretty much an hour. So okay. just give or take. Um, <coughs> yeah. Well, and what, what happened is, is we're building, you know, a 65 story tower. So there's 200 people on the job site working probably. So there's parking everywhere. We start building it. Council comes down. It's two hour and four hour parking everywhere. So I was like, well, I'm going to start riding my push bike to work. Yeah. Drove to work the other day, parked, um, $140 fine. What? For, oh, because for I parked parking. it in the, in the two hour, but they only just put the signs up. So I was like, oh, I didn't know at five o'clock in the morning. I'm not really looking. Um, it's, yeah. But how do you work with, without tools? Um, all, all of our tools are left on site. Okay. So we've got massive lockups and good. sheds and, yeah. So all you've got to do is carry your lunch, 50 cans of tuna. <laughs> that's it is that what you get into yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know just yeah I make my lunch every day everyone's yeah. like how do you eat the same crap every day I'm like well I don't know <laughs> I, don't I know. just do I just do I'm just I don't know I like being in what is it where it just happens every day oh routine routine me too mate like, wake up that time I have that s- coffee have my three wheat bigs have yeah. this routine I feel safe in routines you can't go wrong no I'm like, if, if you go to a restaurant, you eat something, you don't know what it is, and it's crap, I'm like, well, we shouldn't have eaten here. <laughs> yeah. But if you go there and have a chicken parmi or something, can't That's go right. wrong. Like, you, yeah, it's good. Routine. It's, yeah. So what else? What about yourself? Tell me, tell us something. You haven't really spoke much today. No, it's good, mate. But I had a friend in here just last week. Yep. And um, we had a friend who, uh, she passed away last week. Yep. I found myself doing a podcast with a with another friend, yep. and it's a really serious topic. Yeah, and, and I listened back, and I spoke for the first twenty minutes. It, maybe it was a nervous thing, yeah, because it was a serious topic. And and I listened back. And I was just talking. I would ask her a question, and then as Denny is named, as Denny would answer, she'd say like five set five words, and then I'd branch off into yeah. a story from those five, five. And listening back, I'm like, man, I shouldn't have even got her in here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> finally in the end, yeah. but I get the feeling that people start to pay me out pretty soon. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, no, no. They can just press it's stop, all cool. turn it off. How many are you up to now? What are you done? This is number 39, I think. Oh, that's all right. Yeah, you I'm, I'm doing 100. 100 this year? At least, yeah, definitely 100 this year. Yeah, you'll do and it. And I've got a mate, um, uh, Danny Reedy, who's racing a sprint car in Indiana right now. He's coming back. He's doing the World of Outlaws circuit. Wow. Over there, he's coming back um, in about three weeks. Talk to me. Oh, a whole bunch of People. good ones. The, the trick is with this is just getting – it's so new to a lot of Australians. Yeah. I sort of don't know what I'm doing yet, you know, and – and um, but I'm, 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 I'm doing it for some – for people around the world yeah. more so. Yeah. How many people do you and, reckon listen to this? Does it tell you? It does. You know, there's about – say it, it, it floats between 200 and 400 listens a day. Wow, yeah. that's good. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. It's to me, it's real. It's actually kind of tricky to find out because iTunes don't tell you everything. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I'm surprised. You know, um, freaks me out sometimes. <laughs> but, yeah, who's listening? Yeah, man. But the, basically, the, the the cool thing about this yep. is we're not just the the podcast show about motorbikes. Yeah, well, it's just whatever you talk about. Yeah, that's that's what I found. You know, listening so to a couple of your ones, I'm like, wow, that's you know, yeah, so I know that million person, topics. but I've never spoke to him. Yeah. Now I know everything about him. Yeah. No, it's, it's really cool. But, I oh man, I think we feel that's a natural wrap up. Yeah. Well, thanks for you doing this. It's pretty exciting. Haven't spoken yeah. to you for three years. The, the trick is, as you know, come back in a month. Right. Um, um, I'll have some good stories. Yeah. Do you still drink beer? Yeah. Yeah. How come much on. weight do you reckon you've lost? I reckon I've gone from about 90 to about 70. All right. So. Ooh. Yeah, it's good. Beer's good, mm. just like not as much. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You? Yeah. Well, yeah. I I was drinking red wine in the worst stage, you know, just getting into it. But it's, now now I drink a few beers. Yeah, that's healthy. Night. Yeah, but I, I I know mentally right now I'm thinking, no, nah, dude, you actually don't need. I, I never get drunk. It's just like just it could be it soda there. water. Yeah, it could be soda water. But I, here's my routine: is just cracking one of those beers, a Corona. <laughs> Done. So if I'm working on a computer all night or something like that, you yeah, know? you're very computer. It's hooking. Yeah, yeah. I'm a bit trapped, mate. It's good keeping you busy, eh? Yeah. Anyway, righto. Thanks, man. Thank you for uh, doing this. Yeah. All right. And um, uh, what's something on your mind right now? 
Uh, I don't know. I'm going to see Mad Max tonight with the missus, so wow. let's see if it's good. Yeah. Don't know. Have you I've, heard? What it's, is I, it good? I've heard mixed reports. I had a yeah. mate that went over and worked on it. Yeah. He was the stunt writer for the whole thing. Excellent. And Which, who? Robbie Marshall. Yeah, Remember right. Him? Yeah, he yep. did the stunt job. He went yep. over and he was doing all the motorbikes over there for ages. So, yeah, I just said today, cheap Tuesday, I'm a tight ass. Let's go. Excellent. <laughs> so. He did the um, the New Year's, Robbie Marshall did the Red Bull. Yep. Yeah, he's the longest like, jump at Willow oh, and didn't he? Oh, he, that's Madison. Ah, oh. but Robbie Marshall, Robbie Madison, very, yeah. very same, same but different. Yeah, so Robbie Marshall was the, is he the local was guy, local guy from around here, racer, yeah. does all that kind yeah. of stuff. But yeah, he's been over there doing that for like a long time. Robbie Marshall actually raced for the Titan Shed Shed yes. Motocross team. Yes, for what, what did they used to call that? Moto X, Mom, something like that. Yep. What happened to that, mate? Chad Reed was too good. He's, yeah. They bought Chad Reed in the first year. They said, yeah, there's a new series in Australia called Moto X. And um, Chad Reed came in and smoked everyone. Yeah. And they're yeah. like, oh, you're making us look like dummies. Yeah, go back to America. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. So that's it. That's my day today. And uh, I don't know. Just right, enjoy cool. some sun. Excellent. All right. Over and out. Goodbye. Thanks, champ. <laughs> and how about that, punters? Another great week. Another great sunny, sunny and beautiful. I think it's winter. It must be winter on the Gold Coast, but I'm still swimming in board shorts. Oh, yeah. I had a, a massive week last last week and an even bigger weekend. It's um, filming a pilot episode TV show uh, with some friends yesterday, um, which I really think will take off uh, and even though we don't even care if it does it was just so much fun and I look forward to speaking to a lot of great people really soon on this podcast show and I want to thank everyone that has been on already uh, for colouring my world and being champions just like Guy Newman today uh, so and to everyone in the Philippines uh, for listening uh, even more and more lately I want to say yeah. All right, over and out. Thanks if you listened to it on iTunes. Please rate and review, do all that stuff, and um, stay tuned because we've got some big, big people coming into this uh, little chair here in Kurumban, the Gold Coast, Queensland, Australia. I love you. Bye bye. <laughs>